cycle time see cycle time can be uh, for your understanding you can tell like it's end date minus start date okay so if a team if someone is starting a task on 15th of april and completing it on 25th of april that means that the time taken is 10 days right so now hmm. the reason why i included this is because in an interview they will be asking like what is the unit of unit of lead time and cycle time so at that time you should be telling the unit is always in time that means either in hours or in days for example few few tasks we can close even within like 5 hours or 4 hours right so in that case the unit will be in hours and sometimes like when it comes to stories it may take like even like 10 days time right so the cycle time is 10 days in that case so how to reduce the cycle time first see this is also one of the interview question so first is you need to limit the work in progress so what is the work in progress you know right if you are seeing the jira board you can see to do in progress done right so your hmm. team should have only limited number of work in progress items okay this is one of the kanban principle okay in kanban they are having one principle where they are telling that team should have like less number of things in work in progress we should have a limit and then we should close the stories once it is done that means daily we are inspecting right the burn down chart so we need to ensure that the mm. stories are getting closed once it is done we should not wait up to the end of the sprint so this can help us to reduce the cycle time so now another question will be coming to your mind <coughs> if someone is asking what is the standard cycle time you are following means like the standard cycle time is see you are following a 10 day sprint right so obviously if you want to complete a story within one sprint the cycle time of a story should not be less than it should be less than 10 days right it should not be greater than 10 days correct mm. so the so this is how you should answer and like if you want to calculate the cycle time you can go to report